Jamie, come back to the club uh, from your, your own spells and, and Wraith, how do you feel it's, it's gone for you since, you since you've been back here? Yeah, I'm loving it. Um, obviously, being back in around the, the first team is, is really good and feel came back. Obviously, confidence was high from the loan spell and yeah, just try to carry that on into training and uh, the week away in Spain was really important for me and I thought I, I did well. So, yeah, delighted to be back in amongst the first team and happy with the way it's going. What, what were the the most important things that you learned out, out at Wraith and um, how, how good was, was John McGon in that experience for you? Yeah, he's brilliant. Um, I've got a lot uh, to thank Wraith for. Um, it's a great club and they, they give opportunity to youngsters, um, which have proven that throughout the season. There's quite a number of them playing, so um, yeah, he gives trust in young boys and he just lets you play and express yourself, so it's really good and it's a, it's a great place to go for, for young players. And Yeah, um, obviously every game is massive for them because they want to be winning that league and getting back to where they kind of want to be, so yeah. No, it was it was a great loan spell for me. There's, there's quite a lot of expectation at Wraith, isn't there? They're quite mm -hmm. a demanding fan base, they want to be back yeah. up again. Is that, is that quite a... I mean, quite a valuable thing to be able to play with that that pressure, you know, so young and, and, and going out on one like Yeah, that. definitely. That's one thing I learnt from it is is a lot of pressure. And the fans do let you know when uh, when it's not going too well. So um, that was good to play under, and obviously you're going to learn from it and become better for it. So yeah, it was it was good, um, and obviously yeah, they want to be higher in the leagues than what they are. So. The main goal every week is just to win, and you do feel that is a lot of pressure, especially it's the next week when you don't win or you lose. It's it's um, everyone's down, and you can kind of you can feel that it's, everyone just wants to win. Do you think it's it's within you to to get your place in the Hibs team now, nail down a, a spot, and, and get a run in the first team, having experienced it at Wraith and kind of knowing what, mm. what what's required week in week out to, to <coughs> start. Yeah, obviously it's. <laughs> That's my main goal is to try and get in this team and stay there and I just need to keep training well and if I come on the pitch, uh, impress a gaffer and hopefully the starts will come and once I get that then just need to try and nail my place in the team and take it from there. What's the message been from the manager since you've come back? Just to, just to keep being positive, just in everything I do, just don't shy away, just do what I'd usually do on a, on a pitch and, and just express myself and it's good knowing that the gaffer just he lets you in the final third of the pitch just go and express yourself and do what you want so yeah it's really encouraging. Oh, have you set any targets for when you want to break in and get a run of games? Not really nah, not adding pressure to it, just taking each, each week as it comes and, and just every opportunity to try and impress them, I'm, I'm trying to, so that's just in training and when I come on in games. So. It must be exciting working for a manager who does have trust in young <laughs> players and as you say, encourages you to, to have a bit of freedom in the final third. Yeah, definitely. It's, it's really encouraging. Obviously that's what you want as a, as a young player trying to make it, as a, as a manager that has faith in you. So obviously you've seen it with me and Fraser Murray the last few weeks we've come on and in important stages of the game and it's great to kind of to come on then instead of when you're three, four and up and the game's gone, so it's it's really good. What's the expectation um, for, the, for the cup within the, within the team this year? Is the right expectation to you know, get, get to the final? Nah, we don't look at that. We don't set those kind of those targets. Obviously, a good cup run would be would be good for the confidence and and the kind of the morale in the team. But it's it's all about just taking round by round. And if we end up in the final, then that would be good. On a personal level, Christian Deutsch and uh, Mark McNulty have been in great form recently, but with Flo Canberry leaving and Ollie Shaw, do you feel there's a it's opened up nicely for you to when you get your chance take it? Yeah, it has opened up obviously, I think kinda of third choice at the minute, so they're doing really well, banging them in and they're working really well together. So I'm just in behind them trying to push push my way in. So yeah. Like I'm happy at the position where I am and hopefully just just keep training well and see what happens. And you've seen this game against Inverness as a potential chance for you to stake a claim. Yeah, hopefully if I get any any minutes in the pitch, I'll be I'll be looking to to obviously make an impact, a positive one, and yeah, 
just any stage, just try and just be positive when I come on, try and shoot, hopefully score, just anything, yeah.